An impressive result for this country's senior footballers yesterday who took on Antigua Barbuda at the Marvel Lee Stadium. The Russell Latapi coached unit shook off some rust and demonstrated their competency in that friendly international. Jassy Marique was at the game. Russell Latapi made it abundantly clear that kickoff would signal the start of TNT's future as it pertains to international competition. Antigua perhaps read the wrong script and went for an early upset after a defensive lapse. With 10 minutes played though, the Warriors launched their first offensive, Denzel Theobald putting one forward for Kevin Carter to chase. A one-time shot put TNT ahead. The fluency of TNT's midfield play was pleasing at times. Carter was almost always the eventual outlet. He failed to link with Kerry Batiste here. That man Carter, again with acres of space on the right flank, pulled it back to Batiste. The finish was cultured. The visitors pulled one back from this corner kick. Hakeem Thomas on the second bite in the 29th minute. However, from the touch-off, Carter looked to right those rounds. And at the end of a mazy solo run, he utilized his shooting space. Latapi rising from his bench to approve, TNT leading 3-1 at halftime. Antigua remained positive in the second, Gregory going for style over substance. TNT substitute Jason Makano could have added to the lead, but for a fancy stop by Javid Joseph. However, the keeper was helpless in the 69th minute. That's when Devon Jostling strung him up in local palance. And from then, TNT enjoyed the better chances. In the end though, 4-1 was more than enough, and Coach Latapi agreed. Certain aspects of our game that we're working on, and I was quite pleased with um, a lot of the things that I saw tonight. Uh, but this is preparation for the Digicel tournament, and there's still a lot of things that we need to work on. Reporting for CNC Three Sports, I am Jassy Marique.